How it started was that my great-great-great-grandfather was selling clothes and I think lots of actors used to go in and buy their, their clothes from him. And actors were responsible for their own costumes on stage and I think one day an actor went in and said, can I borrow uh, something for the evening? And the Angel family, the word borrow doesn't exist, it's called hiring. From that, we, we supply costumes to every theatre production in London. Then we started doing films, when films started. Then we started doing television. And probably about 20 years ago, we decided to go into fancy dress as well as professional hire. We'd always banked for 160 years with the same bank, but we changed our business. And the bank didn't understand um, that we had these huge peaks where we needed to buy stock in from China or whatever, and, and it was a lot of money. And they got dif very difficult with it, and then it, it was suggested that we looked at asset-based lenders, and we looked at a few, but Arbuthnot really seemed to grasp, grasp the whole thing. They came in incredibly quickly, they understood what we wanted, and they split our borrowing over two sides, one was against the stock and two was based on um, the fancy dress side, which is much more what a commercial asset broking firm would do. We were delighted to replace the bank that I've been with for 160 years and what we provided was a four million pound facility against the stock that they hold, uh, plus uh, one million pound invoice discount facility against the debtors. And what this did was bring together availability of cash, which generated more cash than they would get from a traditional bank or conventional funding facilities. For me, it was a, it was a relief. I mean, first of all, to get people, first of all, to actually speak to the people you were dealing with. You actually didn't feel you were, it, it felt to me like old fashioned banking in a funny way. When you knew your bank manager, your bank manager took an interest in what you did and you had a relationship, and you have a relationship with the people that make the decisions at Arbuthnot, and I think that was really, really important. Above and beyond lending just the money, we're there to provide them a personal service and an approach where they feel as though they can pick up the phone to us any time of the day and talk to us about easy or difficult issues and where the business is going in the future. It's enabled us to expand. We also make our own product, and obviously if we make and sell our own product online, Fancy Dress, we've got a better profit margin. And I think they've helped us expand our business, how we want to expand it. All of the team here really believe that Fancy Dress is the way forward. I think our Arbuthnot have supported us when I think maybe some other banks might not have done.